Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we are in an administration of travelers. Everybody is flying up and down like witchcraft. And uh, the latest news, there are projects when President Tinubu will drop for House of Assembly. You know, say every ministry, money where they need to decide. So all the ministers, they can't defend how much they write. Ministry of Trade and Investment. Inside the budget, they write. Say the minister wants use one billion naira to travel. She wants use one billion to go Geneva. Now they call them, they call defend their budget. Oshomola, who is the chairman in charge of interior of the Senate, started questioning the woman. Say, madam, in a country where we say we broke, where we say we need money, you want to use one billion to travel. Now Geneva, they employ you put. Every time you go that back, you should go that back of industry. It always is here. Now there you want to work, I here you want to work. Why will you use one billion to travel? Madam, sit in your office, use Nigerians to work and do your job here. You don't need to travel. You know what the woman reply, Marshona. The Minister of Trade, Industry and Investment, Doris Uzoka Nite, is proposing to spend over a billion naira on a trip to Geneva next year. The proposed spending is containing the allocation of the ministry in the 2024 budget. Adam Soshomole. The senator representing a donut spoke on the allocation on Tuesday when the minister appeared before the National Assembly Joint Committee on Trade, Industry and Investment to defend our ministry's budget. Mr. Oshomola, who is also the chairman of the Senate Committee on Interior, was not specific about the actual amount the minister proposed for traveling to Geneva. He only mentioned that the Trade, Industry and Investment Minister is proposing to spend over 1 billion naira on a trip to Geneva. The details were not released to journalists, either after the budget defense. During the defense, Mr. Oshomole questioned the rationale behind the minister's plan to spend over 1 billion naira on a trip to Geneva and missed economic hardship that has forced many Nigerians into poverty. I see that you intend to travel to Geneva next year and you have budgeted over 1 billion for that. We can't keep going on with over bloated teams on our broad trip, trips. Use the experts we have in your offices in the country to save costs. Let us practice what we preach. We cannot talk about industrialization and keep importing toothpicks and tires. We must ensure that we have homegrown products, he said. Sit down in your office and work. Mr. Oshomole, a former governor of Edo State, advised Mrs. Uzoka Anite to develop the trade and investment sector of Nigeria through foreign investors. What is our balance of trade, especially with China? Those countries imported things to Nigeria are expected to build factories in Nigeria. We have to take advantage of our population to grow our industries. Madam, sit in your office and work for Nigerians. I have gone there twice. You are always in the bank of industry. If you prefer the bank of industry, you should have declined the president's nomination to be a minister, the senator said. Responding, Mrs. Nkiruka Anite claimed that she doesn't stay in her office because it is under renovation. I assure you that I can work from anywhere and give Nigerians results. My office is currently under renovation. No record of trade balance in my office, the minister said. The minister also said that ministry does not have a record of the country's trade balance. Sir, I regret to say that we seem to have no record of our balance or of trade, or at least it doesn't exist in the ministry. And that is why we initiated a new unit called the Trade Intelligence Unit to ensure that such data are generated and stored. The federal government has recently come under heavy criticism for spending over for sending over 400 delegates to the Climate Change Summit COP28 in Dubai, United Arab Emirates. Premium Times reported that the government spent at least 2.7 billion naira to sponsor the delegate to attend the 13-day summit, which ended on 12th of December. Although Nigeria had 1,411 delegates attending the event, out of which the government said it sponsored only 422. Oshobo, the Minister of Trade and Investment, say me she see that office work. She say her office is under innovation. So, because the office is under innovation, you want to use one billion. <laughs> Take travel go Geneva because the office is under innovation. All these people are drunk. We just gave drunk cats appointment. They are asking the Minister of Trade how much is the trade balance. Now, a trade balance is um, 
balance of trade is um, the difference between export and import of a country. That is, if we they go China, they go import toothpick, razor blade, paper, eye pencil, how much are we spending on importing this thing? Then how much are we spending to export the few things where we export? So let's say we use 10 million, for example, to import, and we use only 500,000 naira to export. It means we have a trade balance of trade of 9.5 million. That's an example. And if we calculate as a 9.5 million, is enough to build the factories of these things we are going to import. Let's go tell the companies there to come and build the factories here. So Shomla is saying, let's what's your balance of trade? Let's know how much we are spending to import things. And how much was meant to export so that we can calculate the difference? Then let's who will tell these companies to come and build the factories. It's not going to be spending big, big money to travel, to import, to do this. Mother of says she don't know. Full Minister of Trade says she don't know how much the balance of trade. Explain to me what else they are doing in that office apart from to travel and ball. Full federal government carry 400. Uh, 1,411 people to Dubai. They said they sponsor 422. They spent 2.30 billion. Then a presidency. And with a hala, only you, one ministry, why use 1 billion to travel? And we have not been able to pay salaries. Not be you should be that. <laughs> not be witchcraft. Not be that. Reason the show me like what they behave like who they think, you know? It's not they behave like who cares sense because the things what they do now. I'm not expecting I'm going to fight these people like this. But it goes beyond fighting. After you call and finish, are they still going to approve the budget? If they still go ahead and approve that very amount of the budget, it means it's a wasted time. Having all this quarrel, you start finish, you finally approve the money, the person still see money collect. So let's know what the end result of all this quarrel will be. If the finally you slash a mountain, madam, you cannot use one billion to travel. This one billion is removed. Let's move this one billion to another industry, another infrastructure. Then that's better. But if you approve it, then they are just wasted time complaining, castigating the person, chastising the person, and go ahead and do the exact same thing that the person is asking.